What's up guys, it's Feev Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you some more insane trading methods that are going to help you make a ton of coins on FIFA 21. Now if you are enjoying the content or you are new around here, I ask that you guys hit that subscribe button. We're going to try to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of FIFA 21, so it would mean a lot if you did subscribe. And then make sure to check out all the other links in the description like Twitch for all my live streams where we're streaming daily now. And then check out Twitter, TikTok, Discord and Instagram for all sorts of content from me. And with all that said, let's go ahead and let's jump right into these trading methods. So guys, we have some really good stuff for you that's coming from some more daily SBCs from the La Liga. So let's go ahead and let's just dive right in. Our first one here is going to be a very simple one. We're just going to be looking at La Liga rare gold position center backs. So in this filter, as you can imagine, there's a lot of cards. You got Nacho Fernandez, Mandy, Jene, Eder Militao, Pau Torres, Sydney. You can go on and on and on with how many cards there are. And these guys right now are selling, let's see, they're selling for about 2,600 as you can see. Let's check 2,700. So yeah, they're gonna be selling 2,600. So when you sell at 2,600, you're going to lose 130 coins on tax. So I'd pick these up for 2,300 a piece. So you're making a minimum of, what is that, 170 coins per card. Even if you pick someone up for 2,300, the maximum that you'd snipe them for. Now this filter is really good just because with all the promo packs being open and the packs being released every day. No, I can't pack anything because, or I can't snipe anything right now because I'm unassigned. But with all the packs being opened... There's just so much supply of these rare gold cards that they're always getting listed and there's tons and tons of them that you can try to pick up. So you can try and snipe those or you can come over here to the bidding section in which generally I find it kind of difficult with these rare golds. They, they do get bid on a lot and I find it hard to win them on bid. So I would typically just stick to sniping these ones, but always check the bidding market because you might be able to get some deals. Now into our next filter here, we're going to stick in the La Liga. We're going to be looking at Real Madrid players, and that is it. So today, the team of the season Courtois SBC was released, and basically that has made Real Madrid players go through the roof because I think, I, I haven't even looked at the requirements. Someone in my stream just told me that they're, that they're, uh, they're up in price because they're required. And as you can see, they're selling for what looks like 4,400 coins apiece. Uh, we'll call it 4,300. So they're going to sell for 4,300 each. So when you sell at 4,300, you lose 215 coins on tax. So I'd probably snipe these at about 3,800 here. You're going to make a minimum of 285 coins a card here, even if you pick it up for 3,800. So it's still some good profit. And the thing with this filter is the players won't pop up as quickly because there's not as many players in the filter, but there's so much potential to make huge profit on it because there's a lot of players that go for a lot in it like Courtois, Hazard, Benzema, Varane, Mendy, Modric, Cruz. There's lots of expensive cards that if you do get lucky and you hit them for under like 3.8k or whatever you're searching for, you're going to make tons and tons of coins. And again, here with this method, it might be worth checking the bidding market just to see if there's any bronzes or silvers that might sneak through for a low bid price. Like this silver guy is always worth keeping an eye on because you might be able to get them for cheap. So that's the only way I would bid on these. Again, this one, kind of hard to win them on bid. I would just stick to sniping. Now into our third and final filter, a little bit more of a high budget one for you guys. We're going to stick with La Liga Santander and we're going to stick with Real Madrid and we're just going to stick Belgium on here. So with this filter, you're going to get Courtois and you're going to get Hazard in this filter. And obviously you get their special cards as well. So with this filter, you're going to go ahead and check what the cheapest price is. Now Hazard's obviously going to be cheaper because he's lower rated. So let's check what he goes for here. So Eden Hazard, one there for 42 and a half K. Let's check 43 Still just the one for 42 and a half, 43, 250. So let's just say he sells for 43,000 coins. So if you sell for 43,000, you're going to lose, what is that, 2,000, uh, 2,150? No, I've butchered that. I've, I've butchered that, I'm pretty sure. No, that's right. 2,150 you're going to lose. So I would snipe these guys for like an even 40k here or maybe even like 39.5. It really just depends how much profit you want. But the thing with this filter again is there's potential for huge profit because again, you're sniping cards that you could get for like five to 10K and they sell for 40 to 50K. But the thing with it is you're gonna see next to no cards and they're really, really hard to pick up anyway. So this is really like if you're trying to hit some big coins and see if, 
see if you can get lucky, but not what I would recommend, but if you want to try it out, give it a go. But guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.